Welcome to CEO Money. I'm Michael Yorba, your host. Thanks for joining us. I have Sean Worthington, president of CloudCoin Consortium with us right now, and currency expert and author. All right, Sean, welcome to the show. Thanks for coming back. Well, thank you very much for having me. All right, we've got a lot of front page stuff that's hitting. You've got something new that you're doing right now, RADA, R-A-I-D-A. -A. Talk to us about it and tell, tell us how you're going to change the world with it. So the first uh, database to get something called data supremacy is something called the blockchain. And people really don't, I've actually taught databases for a decade, so I know all about databases. But we've created another database called the RADA, the Redundant Array of Independent Detection Agents. It also has something called data supremacy in that you can't even nuke it out of existence. It is there and even governments or hackers can't shut it down. And what it does is it allows us to have a counterfeit detection system, which can be used for digital monies, and we've created CloudCoin based on that. But it also allows us to do counterfeit detection on almost anything, like a pair of shoes or a purse. Uh, we can use it for stocks and bonds, digital stocks and bonds. We can use it for digital baseball cards. And so it really is going to open up a whole new world, and we're not even sure what kind of applications we're going to end up with. But we have started a company called Rated Tech, and we're going to start exploring the, the uses of this new technology. How is it implemented? How do you use it? So uh, what happens is that you have a file, a digital file. This file can be embedded in a JPEG image, or it could even be embedded inside of a coin or a dollar bill. So, you know, a paper dollar bill or a plastic dollar bill. And that uh, coin has a bunch of passwords. And these passwords correspond to clouds all over the world. And so there'll be about 25 different passwords. And if I give that item to you, you can then go and check to see if they're real. And you can also change all the passwords so that only you have them. And that allows us to create a system in which there's only one owner of the item at any given time. Wow, okay. So let's say that we have some a counterfeit purse that came up. How would I know it, whether it is counterfeit or it is not counterfeit? So embedded in that would be a, a a, a, a data storage medium, which could be anything as big as a USB drive all the way down to a little nano chip, and it's going to store a bunch of passwords in it. And you're going to then scan it and check it to see if those passwords are real, and you're going to change them at the same time. And uh, the, within a couple of seconds, you'll be able to tell whether that item is counterfeit or not. You'll be able to see a picture of it, a description of it, everything. So all the bigger brands that really have get affected by counterfeit, whether it's Gucci or Chanel or whatever, they're going to start to implement this, put this in, and you scan it with like your phone or, or something. How do you That's right. So you could scan it with your phone, and the the phones have the existing programs in there, and you just download a little app called Counterfeit Scanner. It'll take you just a few minutes to download it, and you could just wave your phone over it and know whether it's real or not. And what we want to do is we want to actually be able to embed this technology into nanochips like, so that we could put it into pharmaceutical drugs. So you could scan pills to see if those pills are real before you take them. Wow, that's, that's amazing. All right, well, this is just a short one today. Is there anything else you want to bring in before we go? No, I think that's the big news today. Thanks. That's big enough. That's big enough to change, change the world. All right, Sean, thanks for being a guest on the show today. We'll be back with you soon. Thank you very much. All right, you've been watching CEO Money with Michael Yorba. Don't forget, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.